Now let's talk about communication barriers in the hospitality industry. So the hospitality industry is a customer-centric business. It relies heavily on effective communication to ensure customer satisfaction. Communication barriers in this industry, industry can lead to misunderstandings, mistakes, and unhappy customers. To make long story short, it's gonna cost you a lot. Right, so let's mention some barriers. So first of all, distractions, loud music, background noise, different languages. Sometimes it's a huge challenge and that could lead to misunderstandings, mistakes and cause frustration for both parties. Cultural differences. Different cultures may have different communication styles and expectations, leading to misunderstandings, right? So, some example, right? So, let's say that means okay, right? For the US customer, for people from North America, and in Japan, it has completely different meaning. And obviously, in Greece, it has completely different meaning, right? So we all stick to um, North America, um, right? Understanding, most of people do, right? So that are located in North America, but be aware that culturally, this can mean something completely different. Communication barriers um, with specific vocabulary. If staff members can like are using if they're using technical terms that customers don't understand it can lead to huge confusion. Nonverbal communication. Staff members need to be aware of their body language otherwise they may misinterpret uh, customer nonverbal cues, right? It's important to read books about um, body language but I guess for different nations could be different body language, right? So, and if it means in North America openness, uh, you know, somewhere in uh, ex-Soviet Union countries, the meaning is completely different. Technology issues. If hotel's website is not user-friendly or its reservation system needs to be fixed, it can frustrate guests. To overcome these communication barriers, be aware of these potential issues. Provide translation services, train your staff on cultural differences, simplify technical language, be aware of non-verbal cues, reduce distractions, and ensure that technology is user-friendly. I talked before about product-led strategy, and I'm a very big fan of nice and smooth onboarding and user experience nice should be nice and smooth for that we can create customer journey map send us a message email us text us so we can discuss this specific procedure for your business